Peace, peace everybody. Welcome to Fast Things Life. And I'm back again with another video. This time, it's about the carnival. Sad news for all of those who always expect every year to go to Brazil for the carnival. Guess what? COVID just got it canceled. They're saying delay, but hey, who knows? We'll see what happens next year. Check this out. I'm reading an article from the American press. It says virus delays Rio, Rio's carnival for the first time in a century. Rio de Janeiro delayed its annual carnival parade, saying Thursday night that the global spectacle cannot go ahead in February because of Brazil's continued vulnerability, vulnerability to the pandemic. Rio's League of Samba Schools, Liesa, announced that the spread of the coronavirus has made it impossible to safely hold the traditional parades that are culturally main mainstay and for many a source of life hold. Carnival is, part of, is a party upon which many humble workers depend. The Samba Schools are community institutions and the parades are just one detail of all that. Luis Antonio Simas, a historian who specializes in Rio's Carnival, said in an interview, an entire cultural and productive chain was disrupted by COVID. So even Brazil, you know, there's this trend, almost everything that the people love, they enjoy, this hoaxy hoax pandemic is taking it all away. We are under the new world order, guys. Sad news for, you know, the people of Brazil, because uh, this article covers, you know, I don't want to read it all, but I'm just pointing it out. They're even going to talk about how it's going to affect the economy. You know, many poor and, and lower class people, they depend on the uh, foreigners coming in, bringing their currency and stuff like that. So, you know, to support the, the, you know, the tourism, you know? Let me read the next paragraph. It says, Rio City Hall has yet to announce a decision about the carnival street parties that also take place across the city. Referring to Rio de Janeiro. But its tourism promotion agency said in a statement to the Associated Press on September 17, that without a coronavirus vaccine, here we go to propaganda, it is uncertain when large public events can resume. Brazil's first con confirmed coronavirus case was February 26, one day after this year's carnival ended. Oh, what a coincidence, huh? As the number of infections grew, the Samba schools that participate in the Glizzy annual parade halted preparations for the 2021 event. So basically, they, they stopped preparing for the 2021 event. Thursday's, um, an, Thursday's announcement removed the cloud of uncertainty that has hung over the city, one of hers hit by the pandemic in Brazil. Nearly all of Rio's Samba schools are closely linked to working class communities, like I said earlier. Their possessions include elaborate floats accompanied by tireless drummers and custom dancers who sing at the top of their lungs to impress a panel of judges. Tens of thousands of spectators pack the bleachers of the arena, known as the Samba Dome, while tens of millions watch on television. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a sad day for Brazil, you know. Uh, that's why I wanted to touch on this uh, uh, article. You know, this is a this is gonna affect basically. Um, this article is gonna talk about uh, like the complaints of the local people. You know, like one one person, his name is Jesus. He said it was a blow. We leave carnival all year round. And many people, when they realize everything will stop, wind up getting sick or depressed. 
Carnival is our life. Yeah, New World Order, man. Sorry. They're never going to go back to the way it was. Uh, yeah, the article is long, but whenever you guys get a chance to read it for yourself. So I'm just, you know, the things I've been saying, the, now the reason why some of you may saying that I switched up, all I'm doing is I'm just reading the mainstream news because that's what YouTube want and just giving it to you and putting my little commentary. But I'm pulling all these news to confirm what I've been saying on my streams. It's over. The world will never go back to the way it was. This hoaxy hoax virus is the perfect storm for the whole planet. Even places where they didn't have it, quote unquote, they shut down. It's 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 over. You know? And sad news is you, you wanna know who's gonna suffer the most? The poor. And that's why it is inevitable. <sighs> Man, it's it's sad. But let me show you before I go. Let me show you some of the beautiful pictures that I found for the uh, you know. Look at this one. You know, the, the this is the costume that people wear. And uh, here's another one. This is a beautiful picture. I know a lot of you gentlemen out there will appreciate my skills of searching awesome pictures. So yeah, I'm gonna end on this note. All right, guys, stay tuned. Thanks for the support, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.